So Speaker Mike Johnson gives uh, an impassioned plea speech uh, on Ukraine as he's defying um, the MAGA wing of the Republican Party. And he said he's going to take a personal risk by pushing ahead with his plans to have the House vote on foreign aid to the Ukraine, Israel, and uh, Taiwan. And again, who knows what's going to happen this weekend. Um, $95 billion, four different bills, um, again, funding for Taiwan. Uh, the fourth bill actually includes sanctions on Russia, China, and Iran, uh, as well as measures to allow the seizing of frozen Russian central bank assets. Um, okay, uh, again, you know, he said here, uh, and I quote, my philosophy is you do the right thing and you let the chips fall where they may. If I operate out of fear of a motion to vacate, I would never be able to do my job. History judges us for what we do. This is a critical time right now, a critical time on the world stage. Um, again, I've spoken about this for some time. And again, what boggles my mind is the, the questions that are not being asked. Um, we're going to send more money to the Ukraine. Well, he, in his speech, he actually talked about, I'd rather send bullets than send Americans. Um, and again, talking about how vital this is. Um, my, it's simple, re real simple. Okay, Mike. Okay, Democrats. Okay, Republicans that, that are pushing for this. Um, you're sending all of this money over there. Buy more weapons. Then what? Do you honestly believe that this is going to turn the tide of the situation? Is it going to change? Are you going to come back here in a few short months and ask for more money? They, why, why nobody's asking that question? Because, again, I don't know. It's because of the answer. They know they're going to do it. They're going to have to. It's not going to be enough. We all know this. To be the case. Um, what is the end game? I've uh, often talked about that South Park um, skit with the underwear gnomes talking about businesses and, uh, you know, how <laughs> first, uh, you know, steel underpants, second question mark, third profit. I mean, it's ridiculous, but again, a lot of businesses in this country are operate the same way, but that's how we, we go about fighting wars here in this country. Okay. All right, you're going to send money to the Ukraine, then what? Then win? That money is, we're going to, sending that money is going to get us to, to win, Ukraine winning. I, I, I don't see it. Um, you know, I'm just saying we, we might want to be a little bit more uh, strategic in our way of thinking. And again, I've discussed this here on the program. Another thing I would say to Mike Johnson is, where's this money coming from? Where's this $95 billion coming from? Are you being fiscally responsible, Mike Johnson? Do, do you have a stash of $95 billion? Is it in some closet there at the Capitol? You guys shake some, uh, shake some couches and, and get some spare billions to send over there? No. No. Again, and this, this really kind of really ticks me off. Okay. You, you want to you wanna, you wanna fight another proxy war? This is part of the problem with this country. Okay is the fact that we, we want to fight these battles. We don't want to pay for them. Oh, you got, you got an overwhelming, uh, overwhelming amount of Americans are well behind helping out Ukraine, Israel, Taiwan. Okay, pay. Okay, raise taxes. Raise taxes. I want you to, ra I want you to uh, start a new tax. I'm not kidding. Every single time you want to start another company, raise taxes. Let's see then, see that because again, most America, oh, I don't pay anything. I don't feel no. Everybody's got to pay. I um, make a national sales tax for our wars, so everybody pays. Everybody, everybody who comes here illegally, everybody pays. I don't care. Where's that ninety-five billion dollars going to come from? Oh, that's right. You're putting it on my kids' credit card. You're putting it on my God willing future grandkids' credit card. That's where the money's coming from. You you, you want you want your ninety-five billion dollars? Okay, well, let's raise it. Raise the money. Do it the way you guys like to do. Tax. 
And no, 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 don't go to oh, all just evil billionaires and millionaires are paying for that. Crap. No, national sales tax. Every single conflict needs to be paid for uh, by everyone. Everyone needs to chip in. So you want to send $95 billion? How, how are you coming up with the money? Oh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to borrow more. We're going we're gonna to print more. Wonderful. Watchdog on WallStreet.com.